Let's get you another story that's uh, coming in from uh, Kerala, where the in the Kerala nun rape case, the accused has now moved the top court. Uh, a. Vedanathan joins us. A. Vedya, what is uh, this Jalandhar, former uh, Catholic bishop, Franco Mullakal? He submitted a discharge plea in the Supreme Court. What are the grounds uh, of that discharge plea? And I'm assuming then the state government and uh, uh, the, uh, the, the nun and her counsel will oppose it. Uh, Sarah, to go back, I'll give a little background there. Uh, actually, this uh, one of the nuns in the Jalandhar accused this bishop, Franco, saying that uh, he uh, I mean, sexually assaulted her several times between 2014 and 2016. So she gave a complaint in 2018. A special investigation team set up by the court and police arrested him, and he was in jail for 40 days. Later, he was uh, released on bail. Uh, so the SIT filed a charge sheet and the trial was supposed to start in um, November. But he, he, he wanted more time than it was uh, sent to November 30th. On that day also it didn't appear. He wanted more time. So it went into January. After that, he quoted this pandemic saying that he can't. So, so meanwhile, he filed a petition in the trial court to, to asking to discharge because he has been implicated wrongly when he questioned the nun about the financial irregularities. That's why he has been implicated. Both the trial court as well as the high court rejected it. So he has come to Supreme Court now. Probably Supreme Court will be taking up this case next week. He wants him to be completely discharged from the case because he has been implicated by the nun.